Hi guys, Crooks in the Clouds here, coming back at you with another review video. Um, today I am reviewing Hookah Hookah Champagne. Um, basic how I got this is I'm uh, on Hookah Hub, they're running the deal where on any purchase you get two free randomly selected 18 gram sampler packs of Hookah Hookah. Um, I got Champagne and White Grape which I will be reviewing as well. Anywho, um, for the cut, this stuff has a very short and fine cut to it. And uh, one thing that surprised me though is how dry it is. I mean, it does have a, some level of moisture, but for uh, this is the this is the driest juice I've smoked before, and I, I was a little bit worried about that. But I started smoking it, and so far it's been smoking good. <clears throat> anyway, when you smell it, you know how, like, with most alcohol fla beverage flavors, you get that typical alcohol smell to it? This is a little different. I've actually had champagne before, and this smells pretty dead on. Though, for some reason, I'm also getting a popcorn scent to it, and I don't know why. I mean, on my first, on the first part of the inhale, I smell the champagne, but as I smell, as I inhale more, I also get a popcorn scent. I don't know why. <clears throat> but anyway, as for how the flavor is, It tastes like champagne, it really does. I mean, I've actually had a glass of champagne before, and this taste is pretty consistent with what it's supposed to taste like. I mean, I was surprised they could get as close to the flavor as they did. Um, as for clouds, The clouds impressed me because, as I said, the shisha is pretty dry for a shisha, and even with that, I'm still getting good clouds off of it. So, I'm a, I was a little worried about that, but who can, who can prove me wrong on that? Anyway, now for smoothness. It's pretty smooth. You do get kind of a throat tingle with it. But one thing I do need to note is hookah hookah from what I've read and from what I've watched in review videos and reviews. You do need to watch your heat management with it. Um, if you're using small coals, you are. It, I was suggested many times, you know, use two coals instead of three. Because even with two coals, it takes a even with taking a little longer, you know, to get it heated with two coals. If you have a wind cover, that's not really a problem. And two, it's easier to watch your heat management with just two coals than it is to do it with three. Because this stuff, if you don't watch it, it can burn pretty easily. <clears throat> but as of my overall opinion of the hookah hookah champagne, it's a good flavor. I mean, I was impressed. I do like alcohol beverage flavors, and this is a really good one. I mean, I was surprised they were able to capture the flavor as close as they did. As I said, the smell is weird because for some reason, along with the champagne, you get the smell of popcorn. <laughs> I don't know why, but I don't taste popcorn in the flavor. I just taste champagne, which... I'm 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 in love with. I'm definitely gonna probably pick this flavor up again by Hookah Hookah. And definitely be trying more hookah hookah in the future. Um <clears throat> anyways, this has been Crux in the Clouds. You guys have a good day.